Egypt, 1821. Muhammad Ali Basha, the great ruler and founder of modern Egypt, started the agriculture of the Egyptian cotton after discovering that an extra-long staple cotton grown in Egypt is the best in the world. Egypt's unique climatic conditions and the fertility of the soil near the Nile River and its delta provide ideal conditions for cotton agriculture. The Egyptian cotton planting starts in March in Upper Egypt and continues until early April in Delta Egypt. In September and October, the Egyptian cotton is hand-picked. This ensures that the fibers stay well spread and soft while keeping their fiber strength. The Egyptian cotton is known for its superior strength, durability, luster and absorption. Its softness can only be matched with pure silk. The high spinning efficiency enables reaching ultra-fine counts. This is why the Egyptian cotton has always been synonymous for luxury and quality. Egyptian cotton is the most important agricultural product we have. You know the history about the Egyptian cotton? This is why we call it the white gold. Uh, we as a government, we're putting all our effort to continue to improve that cycle. We have now a complete traceability of the cotton. We are uh, increasing our funding to continue to improve the quality of the cotton. And we are doubling the quantity of the cotton produced. More importantly, we also developed a, a DNA testing to ensure the authenticity of the Egyptian cotton uh, as a cotton and in the finished product. Um, so as a government, we continue to support the Egyptian cotton and we ask for your support to make sure that the finished product you have, textile or the cotton, is original Egyptian cotton. Cotton Arbitration and Testing General Organization, CATCO, established in 1965, supervises the Egyptian cotton quality in all handling stages, starting from harvesting till its export. In each of the 5,000 collecting centers located in all cotton-producing governorates, the classes of CATCO inspect and classify every cotton bag to specify its cotton grade and cotton variety. All bags that do not meet the specifications are re-inspected by a special committee from the CATCO classifiers. The cotton is then transported to the ginning mills and its weight is determined with weight bridge at the ginning mills gate. CATCO makes seed cotton inspection for every delivered bag to make sure it has the correct grade and variety and supervises arranging the seed cotton bags according to their grade. CATCO controls all technical processes of lint cotton preparation, including the manual cleaning of seed cotton on the conveying belts. The Ministry of Agriculture, Cotton Research Institute and CATCO supervises dragging and emptying seed cotton bags in the blending halls to ensure eliminating contamination and tired locks and that the seed cotton blending lies within one grade range allowed to secure obtaining homogeneous and high quality lint cotton. The cotton ginning process is always inspected and supervised by CATCO classes. The ginning mill classes and the Ministry of Agriculture representatives are there to make sure that the lint cotton variety and specs are according to its documentation.
After supervising the cotton bale, pressing and wrapping, Catco classes mark each bale to show Catco code number, cotton variety, ginning lot number and the company name. Catco withdraws samples from 10% of each lot for moisture and HVI inspection at Catco Laboratories. Each sample is locked with plum and stamped with the classifier's stamp. Catco labs are using the most up-to-date instruments and technology. The fibre testing lab has always been one of the first 10 labs all over the world in the Bremen Cotton Institute calibrations. The HVI system measures the cotton fibre's characteristics, which have the greatest effort on spinability, like fibre length, strength, elongation, micromere, colour and short fibre index. Other state-of-the-art equipment measure trash, dust, neps and stickiness. The moisture testing sector is equipped with up-to-date electronic ovens and issues the certificates indicating the moisture regain percentage and the corrected weight according to the internationally agreed moisture percentage. Catco's automatically issued certificates are among the mandatory shipping documents required by the Alexandra Cotton Exporters Association, Alcotexa. Catco relies on its International Cotton Training Centre, which plays a significant role in creating qualified technical staff of international classes and experts. The training courses covers all aspects related to the cotton industry. Cotton Egypt Association is a proud protector of Egyptian cotton. Our mission is to ensure the true authenticity of Egyptian cotton product displayed worldwide. The Egyptian cotton shall remain as it has been through so many years, the jewel of textile. Our job here is to ensure that it will always remain genuine. Mm -hmm.